Hello everyone, here's a question from exercise 4.2, fifth question, chapter is basic geometrical ideas of classics. The question is, illustrate if possible each one of the following with a rough diagram. So here in this question, your answer may not match with my answer, but uh, my answer will be correct here. You can follow this one, what I'm explaining you here. So it's not necessary your answer should match with your teacher's or your friend's answer. So it's completely on you how you are doing it. So the first question is a closed curve that is not a polygon. So it should not be a polygon, but it should be a closed curve. But what is polygon here? A polygon is nothing but a, a curve or a closed figure or closed curve which contains a line segments, entirely line segments. So it, it should be completely made up of line segments, no freehand curves like this. Okay, it should not contain a curve like this, a freehand curves, but should complain, contains completely line, straight lines. Okay, that is called polygon. So we have to find out a closed curve, but it should not be a uh, polygon. So you can take an example of a circle because circle is, you can see it's a closed curve, it's starting point and end points are same. And you can also see that it is a curve. It's a closed curve, right? It's starting point. Suppose I'm starting from here. This is my starting point and I can just go across like this and my end point will also be the same. So it is a closed figure and it's not a polygon because it doesn't contain any line segment. So this is a first answer. You can take an oval shape or you can also take a, a shape like this, okay, anything. It's completely on you. Now that's the first answer. Now what a second question. They're saying an open curve made entirely of line segments. So they want an open curve means the starting point and end point should not be same, but it should not, it contains only line segments. So they don't want any freehand designs here, only line segment. So you can take uh, anything like this, but make sure that the starting point and end points are not same. So this is my one shape. You can see I have started here. I grow across like this and I'm ending here. So starting point and end points are not same and it is a curve. Straight lines are also considered as a curves in mathematics. In the geometry, the straight lines are also a curve. So it's open curve because the starting and end points are not same. Now the next question is a polygon with the two sides. We know that polygon is a closed curve. Means it should be completely closed. The starting point and end point should be same. And they're saying only two sides. So do you think it is possible to make a polygon with the two sides? Now suppose I have taken a one because a polygon contains a line segments, only a straight line. Suppose this is my one straight line. And from here, suppose I'll draw my second straight line. You can see that they are, it, it is becoming open. It is not closed because the starting and end points are here and they are not uh, same, right? And if I draw this side also, like if I draw it from this side, still it is an open suppose i draw it like this also you can see that you can see uh, like there is a gap between them so what we can conclude from here is it is not possible if you want to draw a polygon it should minimum contains a three line segment that is to form a triangle so the answer is it's not possible because a minimum to make a polygon we require a three sides minimum three sides that is that forms a triangle but with two sides, we cannot form it. So answer will be no, it is not possible. Has the polygon having at le uh, least number of sides is a triangle, which is a three sides. So that's it. I hope this question is clear. In case you have the question or doubt, you can drop a comment. Thank you so much for watching.